I mean, this one right here. For Joyce Ricks. A recent stamp, and it represented the, the 75th anniversary of the 13th Amendment. Her love of history is lifelong. Just old things just, I don't know, attracted me back then as a child and it has carried through to, the, to today. From listening to stories from her grandmother to eventually telling them herself as a school librarian for nearly four decades. But she also knows that while hearing history is good, getting to feel it is better. When I taught, I used Aurelia, which are real things to help students learn. They put their hands on it. They can touch and feel and examine things from the past. And so over the years, Ricks has amassed a collection of bits of history from her family and beyond. These two um, ladies are my great, great aunts. And some of those items now make up the first ever Black History Month display at the historic Hanover Tavern. That is, they did until last Friday. I was a bit um, upset and I thought, who would want my things? As that's when the nonprofit says someone opened up this case, which was unlocked at the time, and stole five items from the exhibit, including a trinket box and perfume decanter. The items belonging to Ricks were part of her stamp collection, a straightening iron, and what she treasured most, a Confederate $100 bill. It was a part of my family, and so I've done research on that time period. Um, and I still have the memories. The hey, bill is gone now. We're sad it happened, but if we could have a change of heart and things could be returned, that's all we want.